In this video, we show you how to install brushes into Photoshop. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. We really do appreciate it. And let's get right into this guide. Here we are on Photoshop and let's get into adding some more brushes. So the first thing you want to do is go and download some brushes if you haven't already. If you already have brushes you want to install then you can go and skip this first part of the video. So if you're looking for brushes, I'll show you how to get some now. A great website I recommend is called Brush Easy. So you spell that B-R-U-S-H E-E-Z-Y, just like so, and it's brusheasy.com, that's the official website, and there's a load of free um, Photoshop brushes. I'm just going to look at some top brushes, just like so. Um, so these torn paper brushes are really cool, let's click on these, and then all we need to do is hit free download, just like so, and the download is going to automatically begin. And here is the download, it's a zip file. Now it's important to know every browser is slightly different, but you can always go and find your downloads in your file explorer in the downloads folder. I'm gonna go and drag the zip file onto my desktop just like so, and there we go, and then we can now close off of Google Chrome or whatever browser you're using. Now you want to just go and open this zip file up, and I'm just gonna go and drag this ABR file onto my desktop. Now it's important to note this ABR file, um, ABR is basically the brush file for Photoshop. That's really important we've got that there. Then you want to do is open up Photoshop once again and then go and press on the brush button up here. And then all we want to do is go and press on this settings cog and then come down this list here and go and tap on import brushes just like so. And now let's go and go to our desktop just like this. And as you can see, we've got torn paper brushes. I've selected it, then go and press load. Then give it a moment and it's going to go and import them. And all we want to do is scroll down and as you can see here, we've got this folder for torn paper brushes. I've gone and tapped on it and here they all are. So now let's just go and create a new layer just so I can show you guys. Um, and I'm going to go and make this black and then we can go and start using it. As you can see, you'd usually just tap it singularly. As you can see, I could then go lost across the edge uh, making a really cool effect. If you found this video useful, please go down below and consider leaving a like. Peace.